All right, I think everything should be set up. Um, okay. Yeah, I figured we'd play some more of this. I really enjoyed uh, this on Saturday. By the way, I figure out why Soldier of Fortune wouldn't run. Um, turns out it was a Windows 10 update that broke it. I, um, I had just recently finally installed uh, a couple of Windows updates that I was missing, so... Well, then broke it. It's fixed now. I'll be able to play Soldier of Fortune. I figure since we started this, so let's let's keep going. Okay, we're still speed one. Awesome. Uh, what are we even trying to do right now? C19 and engine. Are we currently investigating this engine? We are. We still need more maths and astronomy. Um, okay, these are upgrading, that's why we're so negative. Go to C19. Oh, we haven't even been there. <sighs> and what, there was some kind of discolored soil here? You find a deserted strip mine. Several metal canisters have messages painted on them. You finally determine that the message reads, Smythe Refineries, Hermes Station. Do not delay. Return of these absorber canisters to J13. Uh, so that's fun. Hermes. Hermes J13. We won't be able to do that for a while. Just a little bit of exploring. Once our factories are done upgrading, um, I think we really need to pump out some more robots. Don't have to optimize this all. I should make a spreadsheet with all of the um, the building types and their requirements, and I can just create like an optimal. Here's how to maximize robots while being self-sufficient. turns. We plan to investigate the properties of the unusual crystal we found on Rhea, sir. It has unique optical properties, especially its ability to polarize light. Cool. Um, yeah, I'll check that out as soon as I can. Is that going to be uh, upgraded lasers, maybe? Captain, we're experiencing what? a malfunction in the cryo chamber system. A massive 
the okay. monster is just going to feed back into itself any minute now. We must get as many personnel and resources off the Calypso as possible. We've only got a few moments. I'm afraid there's no way A few to moments? Well, I hope that that is an exaggeration. Pause. No. <sighs> Colony. Calypso. Frick, how many people can we even fit here? I have no ships. Why? 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 It's the fastest way for me to get this to Calypso. That maybe? Oh. We'll see if this is any faster. Oh no, not this. Hard to order. Zero turns. Yeah, I mean, this seems a little bit stupid, but this is the fastest way for me to get them um, to get them to the Calypso. Ooh, do we risk a pipeline? I don't know. Upgrading the habitats to have more room to fit people waking up be just as good. Try to move as many resources. Oh, resources as well. Crap, are we going to lose robots? Uh, where do I have my vehicle factory? Damn it. Make vehicles. Let's just churn out vehicles into turns. <sighs> so let's see. We still need one math, one astronomy. What's this crystal? Invention complete. Yeah, it's lasers. Who cares? I hate lasers. What did we just invent? We're still inventing the engine. Oh, is it this thing? Did we just finish this? Oh, hey, Ace. My cryopods are malfunctioning, and so I'm trying to get people off of my space station. room we have to make. Pipeline. Send robots to New Terra. Please. Two trips. Is this trips left including the current trip or not? I don't know. 
just see what happens. I don't know how much of this other stuff I need to get out of here. It's all life support. Yeah, I can do that. I already have the mads. Oh no. Uh, I think I still need some more astronomy though. I think that we want this for sure. So I'll wait till, I'll wait till we get our last astronomy. And I'll change it to physics. Wait, Ace, are, are you not streaming, Ace? I figured you'd be streaming at this time. Oh, maybe you are, man. That's why you haven't said anything else. Oh, that stinks. Stay up too late? You just had a rough day. Chili dogs to fuel yourself. Were you the fastest? It's all worth it if you were. Oh. Well, Alright. Fastest walker in the West. being fast. I know you've said that normally you're very slow. What a, what a good job you're doing. Oh. 
Oh, we got our astronomy. Let's change this to physics. Invent. <sighs> okay, we need more math for the lasers. Okay, so you do two laps one direction, and then two laps a different direction? is a lap or how long is the whole thing if you know some people just now. I don't know what happens when I have a pipeline going, bringing humans here when there's no room for humans. They might just get tossed into the void. Send people to Kiwi, can't we? Yeah. Let's... Let's make room on Kiwi. Go to the Clipso, go to the Clipso. Are they from New Zealand? Or do they just like kiwi fruit? Or do they look like a kiwi bird? Her name is actually kiwi? Oh, okay. Crisis is averted here for now. There's very little people left uh, back on the clubs, though. Let's turn that off for now.
guess, I guess I can send my ships further now. on Hermes. Make sure sector's clear. Parmesan. Let's just gather everything that's still in here. holes to the surface which have been filled with tiny pebbles veins of multicolored granite Let's go check it out. Maybe we can find some robots. That would be ideal. Okay, we'll have to come back. You find an old Tantalus mining camp. One crate has the words Property of Smythe Refineries, Alpha Asteroid 5, Camp A4. Well, how fortuitous. I think that Alpha Asteroid 5 is where we have a probe. A little bit upset there wasn't a robot down there, though. Factory will do mining. Now we have a bunch of humans on the way. We actually need robots pretty bad.
Where are all my other vehicles? Do I still have people doing pipelines? I do. Okay, we'll just let that chill and see what happens with that. But we definitely have a bugged out pipeline. We're lucky it's just the one. Now we can go further, we can send another probe out. Eight of five, maybe. No, we can't quite reach anywhere else. Cool. Uh, so, when's this cryo malfunction going to happen? still going. What else do we have? Just doing nothing. Aries. Let's explore Aries. Aries colony be called. The Bimbap. Sure. I'm pretty sure we have somewhere to explore here, so. Oh. A photographic sweep of Aries has revealed some ruins in Sector K9, sir. You may wish to have a team investigate the place before the blowing sand buries it. Well, it just so happens I'm uh, not that far. Canine. Alien pepperonis. You discovered that this outpost was run by the children of Rhea, a home for orphans of the Tantalus colonies. In an electronic workshop, you discover some notes left by the supervisor. The meters have been sent to the mother house on Gaia. Or Gaia, sorry, in Sector 13 for distribution. Profits will benefit all our chapters. Well done! Sector 13. Sure. Do we have a thingy in here for that? Okay, Gaia, Sector 13, we do. really wants to get those bifocaline crystals. Oh, okay. I think we got enough people off. Fingers crossed. Kidding me. In the cryo chambers themselves, we lost 200. We had plenty of room for him, though. Why didn't we wake them up first? A tragic loss. I'm sorry, sir. We had no way of stopping it. Jeez. B11, though. B11 Aries. We'll go check out the damage after this.
In an empty outpost dome, you find the electronic lab of the late eccentric genius Anton Petrovsky. In the memory chips of his Max 9000 notebook computer, you find sketches of an unusual radio and some mathematical equations. Oh, we didn't go look at the Calypso. I forgot. In a deserted solar power station, you find a torn wall hanging. It appears to be a recruiting poster and reads, Join the pioneers on Ares! Sector H2 is not for cowards! So, what is going on here? Okay, it doesn't look that bad. Um, oh, because I put this online. Let's turn that back off. What is this? Dr. Petrovsky was designing a radio that warps nearby space to a limited degree by flooding it with transcendental radiation. A large, solid object, say a planet, for example, bathed by the radiation would show a series of anomalies. Of course, we don't know what Petrovsky meant by transcendental radiation. Okay, I definitely want this thing. the heck we're gonna do about ore. Let's turn that off, we don't need it. Now, honestly, this shouldn't really be online either. Uh, okay, alternatively... These three. We'll keep these three online. Yeah, okay. That should be good. And geez, there are places that need robots but don't have enough robots to spare. sent a probe out there, but... Oh jeez, that's all the energy we have? Holy cow. Okay. Uh, there was, um... What did we find there? We found something. Oh yeah. Was it this thing telling us to go to Ares H2? We found a, a recruiting poster. Let's go pro beta 5 while it's this close. And we'll have two ships out in the beta asteroids so we can then send another one out even further. 
I mean, I'm sure if there is, there's a whole lot of Prometheus that we have not explored, so... I definitely think that there is sus stuff there. Let's just create robots on Kiwi. Send this one back to the Calypso. With some energy. So Aries H2. Let's see if this recruiting place is still there. slowly covered the geodesic dome of a recruiting station. In what must have been the administrator's office, you find some notes in a desk. They read, Further analysis of the alloy must wait until we get new samples from Prometheus Rampo Camp in Sector B-10. Rampo Camp. Uh, so I guess we're going right back to Prometheus. B-10. from the system's early history can be found deep under the surface. Mm -hmm. Oh, I found green metal. A glint of reflected sunlight leads you to a rock outcropping where you find a greenish metal. The metal substance we on so see, that was sus. other colonies. That changes us to robots, robots. We need more robots. is I can, if I want to create a fourth factor, it has to be a level two. Let's see if we can stay self-sufficient with two robots factories. I don't know that we can. Yeah. Robots. Need robots. need to mine more as well. Oh jeez. Let's go look for more ore. some more here. Oh, 
<laughs> we left one ore. Fantastic. Ooh. A mineral outcropping contains radioactive elements. A naturally occurring magnetic field surrounds this area. Well, that's cool. I always appreciate some physics. It's one of the lowest points. Research even triggers that. But we'll definitely need to work to make sure we can keep our ore up here. Bibimbap. Bibimbap needs robots. Let's send them 12 robots. And 36 of that. Sure. Makes perfect sense. And that'll be the next colony that we um, set up. Okay, we have better sensors now, so... So wow, we can find some deposits in places we've already explored. different. The metal alloy, oh there's that green metal. The metal alloy is most interesting. It appears that the molecules change polarity continuously when placed in an external electric field. They act somewhat like miniature dynamos. At this point the overall charge of the metal is zero. We are not sure what use, if any, the alloy will have. We are studying subatomic attraction and repulsion in hopes of improving our fusion processes. In effect, the process will burn quarks, that is, quickly transform quarks from one variety into another, and therefore accelerate interactions of the strong nuclear force. Until the process is working, we won't know how useful it is. There's just too much stuff I need to invent. I guess I need to go do some more exploring. That's the best way to get more um, research. Yeah. I guess let's just do the surrounding. Get 
get back to the colony, we'll save again. Whoa. Yes. Shifting winds have blown dunes into overlapping wave patterns. Dune, Mathematics Planet. This arrow was once the floor of a shallow sea, and the ancient mud has formed an hexon hexagonal pattern. Well, I guess we still have some um, places to go on uh, Gaia when you go search Sector 13 somewhere. Let's go check that out. 13, that's probably closer to Ace's Alley. Yeah. Oh, but where will it be? Let's just go down uh, from the top. Most of these should have nothing. Uh, but some will have these new energy deposits. anomalies that make this much easier. Okay, I guess there are new ore deposits as well. Sending some of that to the Calypso. How's, how's Kiwi doing? More, hmm. Why don't we have any human growth here? Yeah, we should be getting more humans on Kiwi. I don't get it. Are there not enough people? Ooh. 
We still don't have our robots over here at the Bimbap. Unfortunate. a ton of ore. Oh my goodness, how much ore is here? It's crazy. piece of ore has had like hundreds in it. I do wish there was like more of a like colony building aspect, like maybe I could build mines on on this part of the map or something. I don't know. I wish it was a little bit more in depth. played around the same time as this was Outpost, and that had a really big, em and that's just one planet, but had a really nice emphasis on, like, resource management that I enjoyed. be something in Sector 13. Oh. You find a weed-infested graveyard containing piles of unburied bodies. A makeshift cross is raised over one pile with an inscription that reads, Children of Rhea, the orphans of Tawara's Ferry from Sector I-27 are now at peace. I-27. I'm assuming on Rhea. Yeah, okay. Um. So we have something on red and something on alpha five. discover a load of unusual metal. This material may prove useful in future vehicle construction. is quite unusual, sir. It seems to absorb energy of all levels. Not only does it block the gamut of the electromagnetic spectrum, it also absorbs kinetic energy. It might serve as a new form of armor for our spacecraft. Oh man. Cork burning? I need to save up for this. I need more 
more astronomy. Oh yeah, what are we naming our Alpha Asteroid Base? There we go. Really boring. The Bimbap still has no robots. Let's look for astronomy then. No, no, we don't want to look for astronomy here. We want to on Prometheus. variety of sulfur compounds. And whoa, that's a lot of piles of poo. There are shallow fault lines throughout this area. And they're mine now. I was thinking though that a moon would have more astronomy. Physics is useful too. Your instruments detect that the moon's center of gravity is displaced 90 kilometers towards Rhea. Rhea. I guess Rhea, right? Oh, I think I've been saying it wrong for the last 10 minutes. This area was repeatedly battered by meteorite strikes. Why isn't that astronomy? Come on! Okay, we found one. Your instruments suddenly detect a prolonged shower of gamma rays. You transform into the Hulk. The rocks in this area contain a lot of tin. That should be geology. I disagree with some of this categorization. and just toggle on and off uh, one of the research labs. Uh, I wonder if those level 2 robot factories are done yet. Hmm. That's always useful too. A meteorite impact has fused quartz crystals into tiny optical fiber molecules. Interesting. a small patch of very pure niobium. Is it niobium or niobium? I do not know. Geology find. A granite outcropping forms the tip of an ancient lava plume. Where are you? Oh, right here? Right here in my hand. The air is covered with millions of small meteor craters. Nice. Okay, let's go invent our thingamabobber. Do it. So what do we have choices of now? 
Wow, this is gonna take a while still. Great. So we have a funky metal that we need more astronomy. A different funky metal that we could make right now. You know, it's not even very expensive. We probably should. Oh, but we can make this now. I'm more excited about this than the funky metal. So we need more math, math, and astronomy. Okay, it looks like we don't need those two space stations on Calypso dedicated to those things anymore. So let's change physics back to astronomy. doing here? 13 turns left. Alrighty. Mabimba, you have robots now. What is this thing? Anti-meteor gun? I don't remember which places that's actually useful for. Damn it, I just don't remember. Our scanners are probing the beta asteroid. The telemetry data will be downloaded into our ship's library, so... Sweet. Okay, we have a habitat building now. Let's send this thing back to the Calypso. Calypso, can you please send some humans my way? Humans to Babimbap. already. We are now creating this. Uh, okay. Rhea, let's go to I-27 from Kiwi. Oh no, why are we losing... Darn, I don't think we have enough robots. Robotniks. on cycling, I can put down another power plant. Wait, is Kiwi generating humans yet? Yes, we are. Awesome. Uh, need a couple more robots. at I-27 while we're here. Oh. While examining a crashed freighter, you notice an unusual module on the control panel. You make out the letters AEROSENSOM on the module, which you take for further study. Then some. The diary we found at the Tenor Colony site indicates they developed a special filter which allowed them to find more natural resource deposits. I think we should follow up on the clues in the diary. Sure thing, boss. Oh, well, I'm the boss.
Okay, no, uh, no leads right now. I'm assuming... This thing should give us more leads. Need one more math. Are those the only two things? Okay, no, so we have three things to invent. And math is what's holding us back on almost all of them. So this is the only one that needs astronomy. So one more astronomy, and we need like four math. Okay. Why do we have so many ships at the clip, though? We got our humans. I don't know how we got our humans so quickly. Very surprised. There's definitely like something funky happening. So we have ships. Oh, I don't want just gas. All planets. What do we have in orbit? Okay, this has enough fuel. Let's, uh, let's go hang out. Oh. My guess is we won't be creating a colony here. Oh, maybe we can. Should I just create a space station? Craig Collinon's little baby asteroid. Babby. Okay, what else do we have? Um orbit. Yeah, our other beta five. Refuel here and immediately go out on a probe. Um, yeah, we could probe Zeus. Sure, and we'll create a space station there, uh, I guess, at some point. Again, 12 robots and 36 of these. Transport. Where should we set up another more permanent colony? It'd be nice to have Babby able to, um, yeah. Right. Yeah, 
Yeah, I think that makes sense. I don't know. Maybe it doesn't. Another one of those somewhere else. Where? Hmm. So Babby is covered. Omega? I guess we should probably colonize um, Hermes and uh, Prometheus first. Yeah, Hermes. Transport to Hermes. Go for it. What did we just invent? Cable invented. Sure. Still inventing this. Okay, we have a Sarconi sensor. Still working on this. Still working on this. I'm not sure what we actually just finished inventing. Was it this? I don't know. robot facilities up. Okay, and that actually looks good. Oh, except for our life support. another one of these. Darn it. We're going to want another power plant. At least I think that we will. Let's see how that works out. because I want to keep our ore production high enough to cover the Calypso. I feel like I'm just getting ships randomly appearing at the Calypso. chill now. Prime 
Parmesan. You have robots now. And you have an extra ship. do fine there. Do we have our... No, we don't have our robots of Babby yet. Okay, that's not bad though. that from planets though why do you need space stations for that i don't get it why would we build a space station when we can't make them self-sufficient sir we have analyzed some photographs of the alpha asteroids that were taken by one of our long-range telescopes on calypso it's quite possible that there is a man-made structure of some kind on alpha 2 we should explore there when possible during our initial testing of the subwarp radio we recorded an anomaly at or near Sector D-21 on Hermes. I have no idea if this was a glitch during testing, or more likely background noise, but I still suggest we check it out, sir. Sure thing. Make sure those are both in my PDA. No, that's not my PDA. Does it get an anomaly on Hermes? Okay. Jeez, we really need um, life support here. Oh, okay, we're good now. Just in time. Well, is it even going to be worth it to have this power plant online? gonna need seven of our life support we'll be back down generating just like two. Oh well. Okay things are going well up here though. We have plenty of ore now. John needs humans. Let's send them some humans. Transport. Parmesan. Delicious humans. Parmesan. Oh, there's something on Hermes, wasn't there? D21. First, let's check out D21. otherwise empty science lab, you find a hibernation pod. Inside is the dehydrated body of a Tantalus colony physicist. His pocket tag reads, Dr. Carlos Morales, Prometheus Super Metal Retrieval Team, Sector 7. Super Metal? 
It has come to my attention that one of our team members who investigated the Tantalus Science Lab on Hermes uncovered the location of the planet's main control tower. He failed to report through the proper channels and has just come forward with this information. I That's four. I this last of duty, sir. But in the meantime, you can send an exploration team to Sector F4 on Hermes to verify the validity of this finding. I will, I will. F4. Along parallel grooves in the ground can be found thin deposits of pure lead. Wow, nice. While examining the empty control tower of the main Hermes launch pad, you find a shipping manifest that reads Forward Mintronic Filaments to Hebe Sector F2 Labs for further processing. Well, we don't have anything at Hebe yet, so Hebe. Let's just send this thing back to the Calypso. We're all doing swell. Two turns left here. Now what are you doing? Four turns left there. Okay. Let's do some exploration. something here? There's a new... something new. A glint of blue metal draws your attention. It's a gun barrel! All around are the skeletons of Tantalus soldiers who were killed in an ambush. I wonder what could be killing them. I look forward to killing you soon. Pretty sure stuff's going to go down relatively soon. A shuttle lost its front wheel assembly during landing and slid off the runway. Cool. A ship has crashed here. There's a lot of blood but none of the crew can be found. The pilot's orders are next to his chair. We're short of spacecraft ourselves. The missing shuttle was lost in Sector I area between coordinates 25 and 28. Its cargo must be recovered ASAP. Sweet. Getting clues. Clues. and just leave it offline pretty much everywhere, right? I have a strange feeling it's going to be here that I need it. Our spacecraft at Zoop has detected a magnetic anomaly along Meridian F on the second moon. We should reconnoiter that area as soon as possible. Yeah, I'll reconnoiter it. more turns for lasers. Still need two more maths. Yeah, 
let's send a couple more robots to Bibimbap. How many do we need there? One, two, three. Probably a lot. One turn left on this. And we'll see if we even have... Okay. So what, this should go to seven, right? So we need like five more robots here. Okay, easy. Let's send six. Transport to Bibimbap. Six robots, please. And you know, send them some of this stuff too. Bimbap, can you send back a shuttle to Ace's Alley? Transport. Nice. build anti-meteor guns. It does feel like a little bit of a waste. Because I, I think there's only one or two places that we actually ever need them, if I can remember correctly. I don't know if it's Hermes or Ares or both. Definitely build one, Adam, Aries. Um, I'm still waiting for humans at Hermes. And they'll probably need a few more robots as well, it seems. Nice though. Humans at Parmesan. Going for robots at the Bimbap. Ave Maria isn't doing anything. Babby's waiting on robots. I think that's it. Go explore more. Oh, we should have started from Ace's Alley. Inside an abandoned military transport, you find a few pieces of paper. A sundial peddler. Oh, I've never seen the Disney Hercules movie. Alex has. Uh, 
goofy piece of paper. One reads, we destroyed the Hrak spacecraft's weapons, but we lost 90% of our fleet in the action. Please advise. Okay, bad news is, I think, on the way. You, you actually watched the whole movie in class? That's neat. That's just a weird kind of movie that I watch. This was once the communication center of, of Gaeta. All equipment has been destroyed. There is a message on the wall. Thou shalt not sin again. Touch not the pylons there, the messengers. We must construct additional pylons. Oh, robots, yes, yes, yes. Give me these robots. Precious babbies. 24 robots. One large group of robots stand linked together here. They're the Tantalus robots and are slightly more advanced than our own robots. They'll make fine additions to the team. Um... Like, we didn't necessarily watch educational movies either. I'm not saying that a movie has to be, like, uh, a movie that's meant to be educational. But there are lots of movies like um, Ben-Hur or stuff like that that are, like, interesting from, like, a historical standpoint, even though they aren't intended to be educational movies. Usually those are the sort of things that we'd, we'd watch in class back in, back in my day. Just watch Saw if you want to watch someone chopping their leg off. Uh, yes, mathematics. Let's get as much science as we can out here. A deep sinkhole was formed when hydrochloric acid accumulated in this crater long ago. There's a huge salt dome. Electronics. Huge puffy seeds blow along the ground. They build up charges of static electricity as they move, discharging it occasionally with a loud zap. Lush green cactus with giant fronds rises from the desert sands. Well, I'd love to see that. That, looks, that sounds like it would look really neat. Uh, give me more math though, I need math. During a recent earthquake, chunks of feldspar have been exposed along this ridge. Perfectly happy finding some more truncated cones. A transport shuttle has crashed into a hillside. Inside are the burned remains of hundreds of passengers and crew members. Dead vines still twine like clutching hands around the ship's wiring. We're almost out of energy, we have to skedaddle. Send this back to New Terra. Uh, so 
What's Kiwi up to? Okay, everything is fully operational on Kiwi. Oh, though we could use more robots. It's always about more robots nowadays. Capable of inventing, sure. Is that everything that we can invent? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> you're a truncated cone, indeed. Not sure, let's go explore. The ridge of boulders and gravel forming a moraine proves that this spot was the terminus of an ancient glacier. Glacier still. Find a variety, or you find a very fine quartz sample that shows strong piezoelectric activity when squeezed. Squeeze the quartz. Let's look for some cool. train vehicle is overturned on the side of a road. The windows are smashed and there's dried blood all over the interior. A bumper sticker reads, We saw the alien pylon! Uh, this way. When will we find an alien pylon ourselves? Space shuttle sits on a crumbling tarmac. So something very not fun must have went down. Oh, what at first glance appears to be a large, brilliant ruby is actually a broken glass lens. So how boring! I got all excited for a moment. something interesting there. You see a message on the ground. The words are spelled out with large stones. Help us, we're trapped by animals. Interesting. That's right, there are shenanigans happening on Prometheus. blue metal. You find a small abandoned dome near some boulders. Tire tracks lead to a rock outcropping where you see some bluish metal. It's part of an iron-rich meteorite. Oh. Near the wreck of a shuttle you find a box containing carved green gems which are used as focusing barrels for hand lasers. Something else here? Oh. Sunlight reflects off the bluish smoked glass window of an empty ATV. Whoa. 
So I guess even here they were fighting. You found a small deposit of blue aquamarines. I'll take them. Whoa. You're attracted to something yellow and metallic. It is a broken ore carrier crate. Hopes up for nothing. How's Parmesan? Okay, we have our humans. Get back to Calypso. Um. Sure. Mine, please. And we need to get some energy. That is very little energy. Okay. Okay, that should at least keep this okay until that factory is done. Because I did set to mine, right? Let's see if there's anything interesting in the immediate vicinity. Who knows? Near an ancient volcano, you find a large pyroclastic rock containing Traces of a reddish metal. You find some heavily pitted mining equipment on which is the logo Smythe Refineries. You later remove an unusual half melted screen for later examination. Oh? Oh. We are researching other uses of the screen. Sweet. In a trash pile, you come upon a discarded banner that reads, Come celebrate the 15th anniversary of the Smythe Refineries, Hermes Headquarters. love to find robots. A deposit of aqua-tinted crystal projects up through the dust. Uh, where is it? Okay, let's go home. Ten turns left. Jeez. Uh, so how's it been bat? Okay, looking looking good. And no ships though. Do we have a ship en route to Bibimbap? We do. Oh, but it's gonna take forever. So that's exciting. Babby. Okay, Babby has its stuff now. Um, yeah, just go back to the Calypso. Let's build a habitat. Let's get some ore so we can build a habitat. No, oh, there's gonna be like nothing here. Some science. Wow, this was like super, super tiny. Oh. Your 
radio picks up a small burst of static, which seems to have come from a distant quasar. Sweet. We do always need astronomy, so... Why, are there no resources whatsoever? The pitted ground contains traces where antimatter was annihilated by contact with normal matter. Places on the asteroid surface, you find fused chunks of blue quartz. They appear to be from the barrel of some energy beam weapon, but they're definitely not of human manufacture. Dun dun dun! So we have energy, but no ore. Fantastic. You find a large crater. Bits of plastic and metal all around the surface prove that the missiles were being stored here when the explosion occurred. This area contains several deposits of industrial diamonds. So we're going to send ore, essentially. That's pretty poopy. Okay, you go get some ore. Uh, do we really want it from Calypso? from the bit map. One trip. The Vimbap does not have enough ore. Well, that's really inconvenient. Okay, so our transport will get there before the pipeline, so maybe we'll have time to explore and go grab some more. Now oh, that was a horrible life choice, let's go change that real quick. Alright, just go grab it from New Terra. These colonies are looking good. I wish we were producing more robots than that, but... So how well how much are they? How many half dollars? Oh god, I need a lot of math. But we have our fancy laser now. 
80 half dollars? No, thank you. Too, too rich for my blood. Okay, when I get enough robots here... You know what? Let's send robots there. What am I doing? Transport to Kiwi. Sure, send 15 more. Uh, Kiwi, you send this back to Nutero. And we'll set up Kiwi the same way that, um, New Terra and Ace's Alley are set up. What's Parmesan waiting on? Two turns. Bibimbap, how about you? Okay, Bibimbap's fine, I just need a ship. ship, I'll go look for some more ore, and then switch this over to robots so we can get some robots. Because I want to build this place up. Uh, oh, actually, is that transport coming with robots? Yes. Okay. Did we miscalculate, though? Yes, we did miscalculate. I've turned some offline to build this thing. That's okay. Okay. We'll work on getting all of our colonies up and running. doing what? Invention complete. Oh yeah, orbiting Zeus. I guess we're gonna do this thing on Prometheus, Sector 7. If we have. We do have a ship there. at first glance to be large, red quartz crystals turn out to be the broken barrel of a hand laser. Exciting. We need that super metal. Oh. Tiny shards of yellow quartz. That's not what we're looking for. find empty shells of buildings under construction. It seems this was going to be a new Tantalus colony. Not anymore. Come on, super metal, super metal, where are you? The 
remains of an interplanetary shuttle are scattered across the ground. An identifier inscription is etched into unusual metal on the fuselage and reads, Smith Industries, 7 Alpha Astra D7 Outpost. Alright. So Alpha 7. Inside an abandoned lunar excursion model, you find a note. We are returning to Gaia to save our families. Prometheus Outpost 1 has been deserted, so sue us. Should sue, sue them. Yeah. Did I read it wrong? Is that not what it said? I could have read it wrong. Pretty sure that's what it said, but I don't. I don't know. I don't have it on screen anymore. Invention complete. No, I don't want to pay that much for it either. Do you only accept half dollars, or do you accept the equivalent in other currency? Robots. Robots in disguise. Yeah, Parmesan, it's our colony on Hermes. Let's see, we're still waiting for more, more robots on Kiwi. Minus 39. I'm not sure how many turns that's over. I don't think we need to have this be that high. Maybe five. You're negative 39 years old? Or negative 39 half dollars old?
What else do we need? More robots. Alpha 2, let's, let's go probe it. Cool, I'm going to, I think, call that for the day. We'll be playing Oblivion tomorrow and Thursday, just like usual. Uh, Saturday, I don't know. Maybe I'll just do this every Tuesday. And Saturday, maybe I will actually play Soldier of Fortune like I had wanted to last Saturday. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I might I might just continue playing this till I'm done with it. Um, now that I started it. Well, cool. Thank you for uh, watching. Thanks for chilling. I'm going to go make some dinner. And Quinn said I'm eating some bibimbap. So, yum. Very excited. <laughs>